Hello, all you space engineers out there. Commander Kingfish here, and it is day 60 here on the Frozen Rock. Well, in the last episode, we were trying to get the camera system set up, and I don't think it's going to happen. Although, I just noticed something. Not sure what's going on here. Uh... Why? I wonder if it's because I've got the script set up twice where they are a little off. I think we're fine though. We'll just let it go. I'm not too worried about it. I might uh, end up removing that one script down below. And, uh, uh, leave this one in effect, because this has been working pretty good up here, so we might take care of that when we get down there. All right, well, anyway, as I was saying, this is day 60 here on the Frozen Rock, and in the last episode, we tried to get the camera system to where we could sit here in a control seat and look out at the rest of our bases well that just didn't work out and I think it has to do is because I do not have the blocks merged together they are like separate little bases but I've got them tied together with the power lines and I think that's confusing uh, the game and it's just not allowing me to set that up so we're not going to worry about setting up cameras. <coughs> uh, so today, what I thought we would do, at least to start with, is get this hallway uh, built in. Uh, a secondary escape route out of the room here. <coughs> so say uh, something happened that uh, these doors got... Uh, blocked in by something then you would have another escape route out through this direction and so we would need to uh, dig this out down through here and we'll just kind of start doing this a little bit and what I'm going to end up doing is uh, now I counted the blocks out I think I need to go seven blocks out this way and I got stuff to build so we'll we'll build this out here like this we'll get the blocks in which will help guide us there's nothing out here for us to hit and we're not gonna have to drill much out all we got to do is drill enough out to put our uh, hallway in and then that will give me our exit so let's change this over to red and we're still there okay and then we can just plop that in like that now the question is since this is just like an emergency escape route do we want to build it like a full-blown hallway or make it a little more uh, interesting maybe uh, just get the concrete blocks in maybe some sort of scaffolding along the side uh, so that it really does look more like just a, a makeshift escape route. So I'll kind of decide that, uh, but for now I think I will uh, go ahead and just start uh, getting this tunnel drilled out and then once I get uh, that done I'll uh, catch back up with you all and give you an update. Okay, so I think I've got a kind of a pretty good idea I haven't got it done but I've got it laid out so this is a uh, sliding door right here that you can see and then I'm gonna have catwalks I laid down cement blocks but I didn't finish them the catwalks I will finish and then I put <clears throat> corner lights in now I still have to put another catwalk in here uh, I just purposely left this one off for now and so that I could uh, get my lights in so right now you can see that the tunnel is 
reasonably lighted because this is supposed to be used in an emergency situation and so there's plenty of light to be able to do that I have a uh, offset door right here and then I'm probably going to put some sort of uh, LCD message up here so uh, once I get this a little farther along I just wanted to give you an update uh, and uh, let's show you what I've got, what I got the idea in, and I think I'm going to be pretty happy with it when it's done. So uh, I'll give you another update here in just a little bit. Okay, well I'm just about to finish up the escape tunnel. Let's uh, finish building this out, uh, and I want to paint this, so let's do this. Ah, uh, wait a minute, I gotta do something. That's one thing with this mod, it doesn't uh, always... Let's see, this way, this way. There we go. Now let's uh, paint this, there we go, that's better. Alright, so we've got this done let's uh let's close this ah uh, come on there we go so you'll come into something like this i wonder if this should be green what do y'all think let's see what it looks like with it being green yeah i like that a little bit better and i do like it's just a little bit darker right here so uh we come in here, and then we can kind of come through here. Let's close this. And so we've got the tunnel all here. It's lighted, so you can see your way through. And then here we're coming into uh, the control room. So just wanted to kind of give you an update on that. I got one more thing I want to do on here, so let me uh, finish that up, and then I'll catch back up with here in just a little bit. Okay, well, I think I've got the last finishing touches on here, which is the sign for emergency exit. And so you would come in here and you would uh, make your way around through here. Now, I don't know how much of an emergency exit it is, but it is an emergency exit. So if that portion down in there is all having all kinds of problems, you can get out this side of the base. And if you are having some sort of collapse down at this end, then you can always make your way out through the medical bay and out through the Pondix farm and then on into the garage and you could get exit the underground base that way so uh, I think for now anyway I'm going to consider the underground base or the underground portion of the base pretty much done uh, like I said I've kind of given up on the camera idea that just doesn't seem to be working uh, I know if I had everything connected it would work pretty good so uh, let's uh, let's head back up topside and I'm thinking it sh the Sun should be just about coming up and the other thing we've got to take a look at, it's been a long time since we've looked at the, the to-do board, but I think there's stuff on there. We've gotten a lot of other stuff done, and we have gotten stuff that was on here that was done. So, uh, finish the garage tunnel, the control room slash tunnel, and build the living quarters, and so we've got all of that done. So let me see if I can move that over here. Uh, see if I can get it to fit on here. Let's do this. All right. Uh, 
Will that give us enough room? Let's try that. All right. Uh, X, X. Finish. Uh, let's just go finish garage. Okay. Now let's see if we can. Oh. All right. Let's see if we can get over here and do this one. Oop. Back one. Here we go. X. Finish control room. Hopefully that's not going to run off the panel. That's what I'm kind of worried about. But it'll be close enough. Uh, back one. There we go. I know they're not perfectly lined up, but that is just the way the text is on there. And finish living quarters. Which that includes the kitchen and the bathroom and the bedroom and all of that. Alright, let's uh, do an okay. Yeah, I thought so. Let's uh, Let me try one more thing here. Uh, see if I can really mess it up. Let's go over here. Let's go into LCD. Completed. And let's see if we can just take the font size down on that. I don't know if it'll let me do that. What if we go point seven five? Okay. Oh, there we go. That actually worked pretty good. All right. And then, so now, let's go over here. And let's, uh, we can, uh, remove this. Remove this. Remove this. And I still have never found copper. I never got back up to the bauxite mine, but we haven't really needed that much aluminum. And so I never really got the drills uh, refixed up there. The only th other thing that's really on here is to build the ship. And we will get to that. So let's uh, get out of there. Now, if I think of some more stuff that I need to put on here, I will. Uh, but just kind of looking around the base... Now, I know that there's some other blocks that I could kind of strive to build to. And let's see if we can kind of look at those. Let's go into here. And if we go into... Uh, let's see. Uh, is that going to be all under my modded blocks? Let's go to production block. Oh, here we go. Okay. So, I haven't built a nuclear processor, which that's going to take a lot of different materials. Although, yeah, the reactor components, I think I need some specialized ingredients. The uranium centrifuge. Uh, we've built that. We've built that. And that. Uh, I don't think we built a... Yeah, we did. We built the chemical refinery. And we got advanced similar munitions. We haven't done a nanoprocessor. And then I got the extruder, the plate stamp. 
I don't know if I've built an auto loom yet, uh, wire drawer. So we've done actually quite a bit. Uh, these static drills are not part of the industrial. That is not, but I've built those. Or I might build, build, build those. I haven't decided yet. Uh, so I think we've pretty much built a lot of the stuff. Uh, unless, except for the very, very high end. And I'm not sure if we'll get to that or not. Honestly, I think the next thing I want to do is start trying to build a ship to get to outer space. And then we can kind of wrap this, start wrapping this season up. And then uh, start thinking about the next season. Which I have a couple of ideas I'm working on. I think what I'm going to try to do next season Energy is uh, build a... It'll probably be in the vanilla with the regular DLC. Uh, I'm not going to do it in the industrial overhaul. What I want to do is build a plant that is highly efficient. With automated drones, it goes out and provides and picks up the ore and brings it back in. And at the plant itself uh, is pretty much get it to where it's all fairly self-sufficient. Uh, and uh, that the plant itself will be all connected. And that it uh, uh, is much more efficient in how it uh, is laid out. So I really should have the refinery... Uh, going directly into one or two large cargo bins. That would have made that a lot more efficient on this end here. And because right now what happens is when I uh, bring in a load of ore and it just starts filling up all of the production uh, factories. So that's something that uh, I want to try to work on to make that a, a much more uh, conducive flow. Well, we have run about 17 minutes, so I was actually doing a lot of babbling. So I think this will be a pretty good spot to call it good. And then, and then next episode, we start designing the uh, spaceship and see if we can't get off this rock. We're going to consider this that we uh, got this established well enough that a crew could come in here and take over and I can fly off to the next rock. All right, everyone. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you do, please hit that thumbs up. It really helps the video out a lot. And uh, please subscribe. That really helps the channel. All right, all you space engineers. Keep building away out there, and with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here, and I will see you all in the next episode. Thanks for watching, everyone.